Oh my goodness. Please, I just want to talk to Apollo Flame. I just want to have a word with him. That's all. What oh, is that? That mop in the back live now? Not worth calling out Dragon Sky. Not that way. This is such a long run around, oh my goodness. Oh, why didn't you do you should have done the dumb idiot. You should have done the blast, the lightning blast first. Oh, this is still fun. Still just two presses of A. Encounter rates, yeah. There are a lot of them. There are a lot of them. Still don't have all the mega cards. Five more to go. No, Hollow. Absolutely not. Leave me alone. I want nothing to do with you. I am sorry to tell you, Hurts, that I am not here to save you. <laughs> I am not here to help you in the slightest. I'm just here to get to Apollo Flame. That extra shot to kill him before using my Giga card was definitely unnecessary, by the way, but I did it anyway. Leave me alone! Stop it! Oh, this sucks. I need another card, I need another card before this guy starts poisoning me. No, no! We're fine. Does this bonus area just have a very high encounter rate? Mega Man Star Force 2 has a bit of a high encounter rate, in the, specifically in the bonus, in the post-game area and in the uh, Sky Wave, it feels like. They just really notched it up for some reason. But it's like, it's uh, not super noticeable unless you're in the, the post-game area like I am or in the Sky Wave. At least in my experience. All right, we need to really quickly use a blank card to get Pegasus Magic GX, by the way, to try and make this Apollo Flame fight more, uh, fights, not flight, more tenable, like more doable. I should have like another blank card, surely you would think. Do I? I do. At least one more. All right, I gotta look this up real quick because I don't know it off the top of my head. Mega Man, Star Force 2, blank card. Do, do, do. All right, which one of these is, which one of these codes is Pegasus Magic GX? Also, where is my stylus? Did I put it back in the DS? I did. Give me that. That's Leo Kingdom. I should also go ahead and get Wolf Woods SP while we're at this. Here it is. S-O-P-A-H-G. SOPA HG. SOPA HG. So that's gonna go like this, 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 this. That's SOPA and then HG, I said? Oh, input. I didn't get to put in the sixth one. Did I accidentally double tap one? Can you double tap these? That was weird. There we go. It kind of looks like a Pegasus a little bit. Nice, got it. All right, so unfortunately, we can't have three Giga cards, at least not with the setup I have, but give me that instead of Dragon Sky GX for the time being. And then go ahead and show me, do I have another blank card? Do I have one more? Just one more? I do. Let's go. Let's go ahead and get Wolf Woods SP, because I know I'm going to want that for Le Musa. Wolf Woods, Wolf Woods. I just saw it a second ago. Where is it? There it is. T-E-Q-G-F-R. 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 T-E... Where's Q? There it is. Q. And then G-F-R, I think I said? G-F-R. Nice, nice. Uh, we won't use that right now, but we're going to use it in the future. Is this like the compression codes equivalent of Star Force? Uh, not really. Compression codes were for equipping abilities, and Star Force does have abilities, as you can see here. There's no, like, compression equivalent to make these cheaper. But, uh, also they don't have abilities in Star Force 1, just in Star Force 2 and 3. But, uh, those are just, uh, those are kind of like number man codes. 
like cipher mail and uh, blank cards are sort of like the the number man code equivalent is how I would describe it to get like really good cards or uh, some such. Cipher mail you can get cards and abilities. Blank cards are just for cards that you otherwise can't get in the game. Uh, I think we're we're good, right? Yeah, let's fight Apollo Flame EX. So you're Mega Man. Bring it. All right. I'm so upset that this is the first one I got and not Saurian, but I'm gonna take the risk and hope I get Saurian to pop up. We are totally gonna get hit out of this form. We might even die because of this. All right, pay very close attention to his stuff. Guard? You can guard them! I didn't mean to double guard there. Help. Oh, it gave me the guard on that. I didn't want to have to use extra meteor right there, but I need to like switch to another. I need to, I need to do this. No, it gave me another ninja, why? Game, why have you forsaken me? Oh, yep, it came out. If it had come out the other side first, I would have been fine there, but it did. It, it. Oh my goodness. I'm so bad fighting Apollo Flame. Yo, 420 HP, though. Blaze it, chat. Ooh, hello. Oh, I wish I could side select. What? What did he do? There we go. Alright, I'm kind of getting the hang of Apollo Flame a little bit. Hopefully so that we can do better against his, uh... Whatchamacallit? What do I want to... I want to do this. Definitely. Hopefully we can do better against his SP form. If we just get his normal card out of this, I consider it a win, but we might not even get his normal card. It might give us his, uh... His other thing. Do you die to this? I think you do. Yeah. I forgot what I was saying. Okay, we got his normal card. Nice, nice, nice. That's good, at least. Alright, now we just have to pulse out and then come back in and then get the SP versions to spawn. Let's go. I was about to use a D energy when I just said I was going to pulse out. That would have been stupid. Four more mega cards. Four and three by three solar flare attack. We want the SP version of this and then I'd rather have it instead of the other thing. Alright, pulse me out. Poison's good measure on him, makes that barrier of his near trivial. Does the poison affect the barrier? I would have assumed that the barrier would still form, but he'd still be taking like one damage when he's standing on poison. It's kind of weird that it works the way you're saying, if that's how it works. Not the barrier, just him. Oh, so it's still, like, his barrier still generates, but he just takes the damage from poison? Well, that doesn't make the barrier of his near trivial. The dude has, like, 3,000 HP in his SP form. Poison damage isn't gonna be doing that much. Still gotta deal with the barrier a lot if you wanna get out of there any time that year. Warp me. All right, all we need now, all we need now is General Ariga and Apollo Flame SP. We have to beat them at minimum. At minimum, we have to beat them both twice because we need two mega cards from each of them. Hopefully getting the mega cards will not be a big hassle, but as always, I'm really worried about getting the X cards because they're very finicky. But it's, since we're not trying to get his normal card, we never have to use Card Finder, I think? Because we have to get very certain numbers to get his uh, other cards anyway. I'm just gonna go ahead all the way over here. Oh, you act- wait! Is this your SP form? Do you just always spawn here? Can I fight you this way instead of having to, like, use a, a cloaker and hope you spawn? I sure hope so. Aha, you've come back for more. I'll show you what rear power is. Time for battle, yada, yada, yada. 
Yo! Oh, this is how all of them should be. This is how every single SP enemy in the game should be. Love this. Oh, straight Saurian. A little rough that we didn't get, uh... We didn't get much time with our lightning form to do some stuns on him, but still. Ow. Very bad damage there. That's fine, though. A little bit of damage to maybe proc the EX card. Because we do need that EX card. Go, Gemini Spark. Ooh, big damage. We might actually still just get his SP card out of this. Oh, he only went twice that time. Interesting. Oh, Tribe King? Like, you're done. Nothing personnel, kid, but you're done, though. I hope taking that little bit of damage will mean that we get the EX card, but we're probably just gonna get the SP here. Which we have to get the SP as well, so that's fine. Oh, not this. You cannot guard those. Duly noted. Why did I click that button there? Goodbye. Goodbye. That- we got hit like twice. That might be the X card. I would not mind getting the X card there. Although doing better than that is gonna be a little difficult. No, we got the S. Easily. General Riga SP. That was under 20 seconds as well. Ooh. How strong is that card? 270. That's mighty tempting. That's mighty tempting to use General Auriga instead of Rogue's card. It's 30 less damage, but also we can't do any combos with uh, Rogue's card where like when Rogue hits it does the break damage at the end that does extra damage if the enemy is like frozen or whatever, which would make Rogue 400. But also this is like, you can't miss this attack. This attack always hits. As long as you're standing in the center column when you use it, it will hit the enemy guaranteed. Whereas Rogue's card can be a little annoying to aim sometimes. That's, uh, I'm not gonna lie, that's mighty tempting. Can I just search IU now? Let's not use this just now? I can't... I can't search IU? Do I have to get him to spawn normally? Does someone in chat know how this works? Do I have to, like, leave and come back every time I want to fight the SP enemy? Can I not search I him? Someone in chat tell me. If anyone knows. I have to leave and come back? That's mighty annoying. I feel like they should, like, leaving and coming back to get him to respawn is fine, but they should let me search eye him, because I fought him. So what this means, because we can't search eye, is probably means that we're going to have to, uh, we're gonna save in front of his SP form, and then reload if we don't get the EX card to try repeatedly instead of having to pulse out and come back in repeatedly. Which is really annoying either way, but seems like the best option. That would be too convenient? Yeah, I know, right? Heaven forbid we try and take out some of the tedium in our game and make it more player-friendly to where you don't have to do really annoying, tedious work just to fight a difficult boss. To re-fight a difficult boss, to be more specific. Nailed it. Well, we gotta do what we gotta do. Kids are bubble. Really wish you hadn't moved there. Goodbye. We're definitely going to end up having to go more than three hours, by the way. We're about two hours and 40 minutes right now. So that means we got about a half hour in stream normally, but I don't think we're going to be done with all this in half an hour. That was so stupid of me. Why didn't I just move? Can't touch this. Oh, no, wait, no, down this way. Oh, we're gonna have to make this trek through Trans Dimension 2 one more time after this, huh? Oh. 
makes everything way easier. Pegasus is a magical. We're definitely gonna like save and reset for trying to get the uh What the heck was I saying? Uh we're definitely gonna have to um do the same shenanigans for trying to get what's his face's card here. Because boy howdy, I do not wanna have to run through trans dimension all of trans dimension two for every single attempt at trying to get Apollo Flame to drop an EX card. Sounds like an actual nightmare. Super armor prevents busting ranking from lowering since you don't flinch. Really? That's crazy. I had no idea. That's wild. What a strange mechanic. Good to know. Saurian has super armor by default, right? Or at least when they're in their Saurian form. That's really good. Give me a Giga. That's good enough. Time to die. Nice. I saved you, you're welcome. HP 500, 430. Insanely good if I hadn't gotten the 500, 300 from the Cyber Mail. Oh my goodness, that is one big carpet. Unfortunately for you, I got Pegasus Magic GX turn one. Goodbye. Later, loser. Love that Giga card. I love the Sage's Giga cards. Leo Kingdom and, uh... Leo Kingdom GX and Pegasus Magic GX and Dragon Sky GX, all very cool. All right, Apollo Flame SP, let's do this, my dude. Now watch me not get Pegasus Magic GX out the gate against uh, Apollo Flame here. Please give me Saurian form against Apollo Flame out the gate. That would be ideal. And then give me Ninja shortly after. Do not give me Ninja first. That's the ultimate like kick in the teeth. Save up, because we're definitely going to reset the game if we don't get one of the cards we need here. Yes, hello. Fighting this mad lad again. 3,000 HP! Queen Ophiuk out the gate is really nice. I think guarding that is the best way to go about it, at least for the way I play the game. This is a pretty rough start. Oh, I missed time that. That makes it even worse. Even rougher. Man, imagine if you had like a lot less HP right now because I haven't screwed up. Oh, your stupid thing is up. I didn't realize. And I stepped into that because I'm dumb. Don't mind me, I'm just being stupid. Ooh, hello, 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 hello. Hold up, hold up. Got a lot of good stuff right here. Might be able to salvage an EX card here, maybe? Stop getting hit. Oh, he has a stupid barrier, you idiot. I'm just gonna throw. Don't mind me, chat. I'm just gonna throw horribly. No big deal. Don't mind me. I forgot that your charge shot gives iframes. Oh, I hate you, Saurian. I hate you, I hate you, I hate you. Oh my, I'm so mad. Mostly at myself, but also I'm, I'm mad. Stupid Saurian charge shot gives iframes. No way I'm getting a good card from this. Just use, use the thing. Die, 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 die. I'm waiting to see if there's actually a chance they give me his EX card here, but I doubt it. It gave me an S on that? Are you kidding me? 
I know I did it in under 30 seconds, but still. Not deserved in the slightest. Not even slightly deserved. Oh, uh, this is like your default damage of 250. That is still better than... Than, uh... Whatchamacallit? Than Taurus Fire, so I'm gonna take it. That should not have been an S. <laughs> but whatever, I'll take it. Think damage taken is not calculated into the score? Like, it kinda... I. Maybe you could be right. I just really doubt it. Because I feel like I've definitely won fights in less than 30 seconds against SP enemies. But I got hit like four times. And so it didn't give me the thing. How soon did I go into Sori in there? Maybe it was that no flinch damage thing didn't make it count or whatever the chat was saying earlier. I don't know. But there's got to be something more to it than just time. For certain. Alright, so now we have to get the two EX cards. Yo, check out this awesome Apollo Flame card. Nailed it. This is going to be the super difficult part, especially for Apollo Flame. Because now we have to get... I think you have to get a busting ranking of 7, 8, or 9. Or maybe it's just 8 or 9 to get a ZX card. I used to think that you had to get an S rank for the SP. So a rank 10 would give you the EX card. But I think I actually got the SP card once. Why did I do that? What was... Hello? Brain? Are you okay? But I think I actually learned that you can get a... Uh, you can get a whatchamacallit. I meant to run is what I meant to do a second ago. If you get a rank 10, it'll still give you the SP card sometimes. 